I'm Shelly Aragon with MMA Monday, standing here with Mike Van Arsdell. That's right. <laughs> right. Mike actually trains a lot of the uh, UFC fighters, currently training Paul Wontello. Mm -hmm. Got that correct. Okay, great. And he is this fight will be coming up. Paul fights uh, this Sunday here in Broomfield against Czech Congo in uh, the Versus One show. So. We've been working hard. So how did you, uh, you were a wrestler background, mm -hmm. wrestled for Iowa State? Yeah, that's what happened. I, I basically picked up wrestling as a kid um, and uh, ended up getting a full ride to Iowa State, when the nationals there, went to the Olympics, and after that I was like, you know, let me go ahead and um, start fighting. Fighting looked like fun, you know, and then wrestling we didn't get paid, so I was like, yeah, let me do some of these fights. So let me do I, yeah, paid. yeah, and then I just got into coaching from the career, you know. Fight career didn't do. I didn't do what I wanted to in my fight career, but you know sometimes you have other avenues you could see. Absolutely. So you started training. And, so and uh, some of the other fighters that you've actually trained with or been coaching. Well, you know, I mean, I, I was at the American Kickboxing Academy for uh, three years as an athlete, and down to Greg Jackson's gym as an athlete, and then uh, I actually helped coach at Greg's gym as an assistant coach for two years. So I mean, you can imagine all the guys that. Or oh, Greg yeah. Jackson's gym, so I don't want to say a bunch of names, but yeah. now um, Rashad Evans had, all, had hired me just to coach him and get him ready for his last fight. I feel like he needed to make a few changes, so, you know, uh, along with Trevor Whitman, you know, made uh, some changes to get him back to his roots, which is wrestling. Then to add the boxing, it makes a lot more sense to be running around acting like you're Muhammad Ali or someone, yeah. and, and Rashad is a pretty good stand-up fighter, but at the same time, you can't forget your, root, your roots, and that, that's what happened there, and then from Rashad, Paul, got word of how you know his camp went so uh, Paul wanted the same type of thing so I started training with Paul. Yeah, that's great. Well, you obviously know what you're uh, doing and what you're talking about because those are some amazing fighters. So um, we'll keep it short and sweet because I know that everybody's busy this week. Thank you so much for uh, talking with us. All right, we'll do a, we'll do a high five. She's the girl, okay. <laughs> All right, thank you.